Now the member for Scarborough Guildwood. Mr. Speaker, the Auditor General's report makes it very clear that Cabinet had F-35 costing very similar to the PBO as long ago as 2010. The Deputy Minister of Defence today repeatedly avoided responding to the question of who authorized the release of the lowball number. If the Prime Minister now accepts the Auditor General's report and its conclusions, it follows that he <coughs> authorized the release of the lowball number, right. he authorized the vilifying of the PBO, <laughs> and he misled Parliament exactly. and Canadians. Yep. Why? Here, here. Here. The Right Honourable Prime Minister. Mr. Speaker, of course, the uh, preamble of that question is completely wrong. As the Deputy Minister himself indicated, uh, the uh, data released uh, is uh, consistent with how the Department of National Defence uh, treated such data in the past. But as we've said, as a consequence of the Auditor General report, we're taking a more careful look at all of this costing. We're committed to uh, providing all of the results of that examination to Parliament.